Guys, we're bringing our horses to an Airbnb. We're going on a little road trip and we're actually spending the night. Sorry about the shakiness, the truck is just moving a lot. Ever since our first trip to the horse beach, we've been dying to come back and we knew we wanted to stay for a little bit longer, like not just one day because it is quite a drive, it's like a two, two and a half hour drive. So we were like, okay, we have to find like an Airbnb around there somewhere so we can actually stay the weekend. And we did and we brought the horses my birthday was last week but the Airbnb we're staying at they didn't have availability my birthday weekend so we're doing it the weekend after which is this weekend and a lot of you guys asked me when I did my first beach ride video what beach we took the horses to I got a lot of emails and comments we took the horses to st. Augustine Beach in Florida that's where we're going this weekend as well it's not just for horses it's a regular beach all you have to do to go is just get a permit they came in the mail after we took a test online basically it's a course learning about the beach and teaches you about sea turtles and not to mess with things and stuff like that that's all you have to do and if you pass the test which is easy you can take the test multiple times I think and then they send you the permit just go on Google write st. Augustine horse beach you can go from there like it tells you what to do so yeah that's where we're going and I'm so excited we're staying in an Airbnb which is gonna be interesting with these guys we brought crystal and Ziggy again this is gonna be their second time at the beach I have no idea what we're gonna arrive to where the horses are gonna go but you guys are gonna experience this with me I have no idea what to expect I'm really excited we get to do a little sleepover with our horses and go to the beach if you are excited about this video please 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 give it a thumbs up if you haven't already please subscribe today we're just gonna arrive at the Airbnb and see what happens <laughs> Can you guess where? I think you guys know already. McDonald's! McDonald's is like road trip tradition for us. We're stopping to get some coffee, some food, before we get back on the road again. We're here. The driveway is so tiny. And then now straighten it. Sharp. Yeah. This is the cutest Airbnb. I'm definitely gonna give you guys a tour, so don't worry. We just turned the horses out and they're just like running around exploring everything. The pasture is so cute. We're just unhitching the trailer now. We're gonna unload our stuff into the room and yeah. Are you guys having fun? the trailer and now we're driving up to the little cabin this is the actual room of the Airbnb it's called a cottage on a farm before we leave I'll give you more info on it if you guys are interested in coming here and staying here the thing is this Airbnb was not advertised for horses but I noticed they had like pastures in the pictures of the cottage I just messaged them like hey do you guys think we can bring our horses and they were like yeah bring them oh my goodness hi donkeys how you doing Guys, look at the donkeys. They're so cute. Hi. Oh my goodness. So this is our little cottage. It is so cute. So this is the little porch. 
They leave you carrots so you can feed the donkeys. Carrots in the refrigerator are for us. How cute! I love this window. You walk in here. This is the front door. This is the little dining room. It's so cute. I love the wooded walls. This is the living room. This is the little back porch. Okay, here's the kitchen. I love this sink. It's so cute. The stove, fridge, microwave. Look at this barn door. Oh my gosh. Is this the room? Here's the bedroom. A little desk area. And this window is so cute. I love it. Guys, this is such a cute little cottage. This barn door slides, and this is the bathroom over here. So cute. It gives me like old school vibes, right? It's adorable. I love it. And we have donkeys outside our window, and our horses are next door. Hey guys, so I just changed into this little dress. Um, I think it's from Forever 21. We're gonna go out and explore the town. I'm gonna go ahead and put some makeup on. I look crazy. The lighting in here isn't too good. Anyway, tomorrow we are planning to go to the beach and I'm extremely excited because because since the horses have gone already, I feel like I won't have to worry too much about like training them or working with them because it's their second time going. I don't think they'll be too scared, but yeah, I'm gonna finish this. <laughs> Eventually. Okay, makeup is done. Carrot time. Oh, they hear it. <laughs> yeah. Yummy. So delicious. <laughs> We're about to pass by Ziggy and Crystal. Let's see. They're still <laughs> they're staring at the truck. They know it's us. Let's see how they're doing. <laughs> Hi guys! <laughs> they're staring. Bye, we'll see you later. All right, you guys, so we're heading to the town, St. Augustine. It's supposed to be like this historic part of Florida. There's a lot of history behind it. Um, I'm not too familiar with the history behind it. I should Google it and see what happened. Honestly, not sure if I should vlog right now, like going to town. I don't know if you guys would be interested in seeing that. It doesn't really have anything to do with horses. Like this part of the vlog won't have anything to do with horses if I vlog it. And I'm not sure if you guys would be interested in that. Maybe I'll vlog it and see how it turns out. This is actually our first time here. Like we've been here with the horses, but just on the beach. This is our first time coming to town and seeing everything. It's so beautiful. They have like a little, what's it called? A historic street. They have like this really pretty street with a lot of architecture and I can't wait to go walk around. Right now we're looking for parking. <laughs> Guys, I got out of the truck <laughs> and I flashed everybody. It is so windy and my dress keeps on coming up. I had to stand this way. That's the only way it doesn't like fly up, but that's embarrassing. We just stopped at a restaurant to grab something to drink and something to eat. It's called Bowl and Crown. I get so nervous. There's so many people sitting around here, so I get shy, but yeah. All right, guys, we're back at the Airbnb. I'm gonna just get out and feed the horses really quick before we head inside to go to sleep. I'm just sitting in the bed of the truck with the hay. It is so dark. I don't even know if I'm gonna be able to see them, but I think they'll come once they hear the hay. Is this creepy? Am I creeping you out? Are you scared? <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> okay, I tried to film some of that, but obviously it is way too dark. I couldn't even see anything, so I totally bet you couldn't see anything either. I'm gonna head inside, take my makeup off, put my PJs on, and go to sleep, because tomorrow we're going to the beach. <laughs> 